Who wants to take a guess what I forgot to buy? Yeah. Ah, it's so much fun! <laughs> Hey gang, and welcome to Let's Go Camping with Ralph Hog the Third. Uh, it is January 28th, many days after Lucas was released. I forgot to buy him. So it's pretty much just going to be me riding around town uh, trying to find a place that has Lucas for sale. It's currently a uh, 529 in the morning. I just got off work. I work at Amazon now at a uh, fulfillment center, which means I touch packages all day. Yeah. Other people's packages are in my hands. Big ones, small ones, all, all different sizes. So we're here at Walmart. We're going to go see if they've got Lucas. And if they do... That, that was really easy, and this this video is going to be really short. Let's go see if they have Lucas. You don't know the power of the dark side. All right, Yokai, watch. So, let's see. Amiibo selection. Still got Tom Nook. Um, wow, they still got modern Mario. Dang. Seeing uh, no signs of Lucas, though. Perhaps behind me? No, that's just a bunch of a Disney Infinity stuff. All right, well, it appears that Lucas is not available at Walmart. So it's, uh, it's going to be a bit of, bit of uh, waiting around for me at this point. So we'll check Target and then uh, GameStop and Toys R Us. And... Um, yeah, that's that's pretty much what it's gonna be for me. Also, I need to play this game, Nino Kuni. I've heard it is basically the shit. So maybe when I get a PS3 slash PS4, I'll play that for you guys. Cool. Well, now that I've officially burned an hour and a half just sitting around in Steak and Shake, my favorite spot to eat and waste time, I get to spend another hour just sitting out in front of Target. So it's actually a camping episode! Yay! We're camping in front of Target! Yeah! <laughs> I'm so tired. 8 o'clock inside the Target. Let's go see if they've got what I want. The last one. That, my friends, is how the game is played. Oh man, look at that KK Slider. If he didn't come with Reese and uh, Cyrus, I would get him. But there's no point, because I don't, I don't do the Animal Crossing amiibo. Mr. Setti's cool though. It's pretty chill, but. Last Lucas in the store. That is how this game is played, even though it's like been a week or whatever. But still, last Lucas. We got him. Time to uh, take him home and, uh, and train him up for the Amiibo tournament. So uh, Ryu pre-orders uh, for Walmart were up. So while I was waiting the hour to get into Target, I went ahead and uh, pre-ordered my Ryu Amiibo so I could guarantee that for myself. Um, so that's Ryu done. And uh, now I'm about to head over to GameStop to pre-order my Roy Amiibo. So that'll be Roy done. They really should have done this shit from the beginning. Just pre-order all the things. It would have been so much easier. You know what? They should have just made everything easy. It, it could have been this easy, Nintendo. Just walk into a Target a week after something's released, and there it is. But no, y'all y'all had to y'all had to short stack it. Y'all had to uh, not release very many. I'm looking at you, Reggie. I'm disappointed. Well, I'm in front of GameStop, and uh, somehow I forgot that GameStop 
and Toys R Us uh, open up an hour later than Target. So we're camping again! Yeah! <laughs> it's so much fun! <laughs> yeah. Doors are closed. It's just, uh, just me and my car and my thoughts. And my Lucas Amiibo. Delicious. So, uh, turns out GameStop opens at 10. So I've been sitting here doing nothing for an hour for no reason. Um, I'm gonna go home and do things, and then I'll just come back here at 10 and take care of that, because I got the things that I gots to do. So we'll be back at GameStop in about an hour. Alrighty, gang. Well, I'm back from GameStop, and uh, I did a little more than just pre-order Roy. Uh, I ended up pre-ordering Roy. Uh, Bravely Second, Hyrule Warriors on the 3DS, uh, Fire Emblem Fates, both of them, because they're, they play entirely differently and they're supposed to be great, so Fire Emblem, yay! I also pre-ordered Star Fox, which comes out in April, and of course, Pokken Tournament, which I'm definitely going to do stuff for the channel when that comes out in March. Um, but beyond that, we've got Lucas... And per tradition, we're going to slice him open and uh, see what he's made of. That looks like a good starting point right there. Yep, super easy. Remember to always cut away from yourself so you don't accidentally murder yourself. Because, you know... Murdering yourself is bad. Untimely murder is, you know, it's just, it's just not great. All right, so here we go. Lucas Amiibo. They changed the little foil at the bottom. It's no longer a square. It's now a, uh, it's now actually inside the Amiibo case. Smart thinking. Smart thinking. All right, let's check this guy out. He's got a, got a little high five action going on. High five. All right, good job. Uh, he's get, get the little hair. Yeah. He's a pretty solid amiibo. He doesn't even have any, uh, stamp, anything, uh, supporting him. Just like, uh, just like Ness. All right. It's a good amiibo. It's a good one. Second DLC amiibo. The rest are DLC amiibos. I mean, uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's DLC amiibo from here on out. We got Ryu and Roy coming in March. We got uh, Cloud, Bayonetta, and Corrin coming in, I don't know when. So we'll find out. Um, so yeah, that's it for this episode of Let's Go Camping with Ralph Hog the Third. Uh, join me next time where it's probably just going to be me picking up Roy and R Ryu and then opening them. Cool. See you later. High five. Sorry. High five. And high five. Yeah. Yeah.